What's going on guys? So in this video, I wanna show you five awesome products to drop ship this Q4. These aren't just random crappy products. I've put a lot of time and effort into this video and handpicked everyone myself. They're all proven in their own right. They're backed by data. They're spiking in popularity and they also make great gifts. So yes, they're great sellers for Q4, but more specifically, they're great sellers for Christmas day. We are at a time of year now when people have started their Christmas shopping. They're looking for things to buy their loved ones, their family and their friends. And every single one of these products is a great option for that. So all five of these products are in niches which are hugely popular for this time of year. They're also in niches that target buyers that are ideal for Facebook. So we're gonna be covering all of that good stuff and I'm fully aware there's still lots of people jumping into the dropshipping space, which is awesome to see, but you are running out of time. If you are watching this video, see this video as your personal call to action. Watch the entire video, pick a product that makes sense to you, that you have a good gut feeling about, switch off YouTube and start building your business right away. To help you get started as quickly as possible, I'm going to be giving you every single piece of information you need to go out there and start selling these products today. So we'll be giving you the competitor link, existing Shopify stores which are selling this product that you can use as inspiration. I will be giving you the Chinese supplier link for all of these products, so this will be the AliExpress link. However, what I suggest is importing it into your store and then seeing where else you can source it from and seeing if you can actually source it locally if you want to take full advantage of Q4 of Christmas. It's much advantageous being able to sell it up to say the 18th, 19th, 20th of December. You just can't do that if you're drop shipping from China. Next, I'm gonna be sharing with you an ad creative link for each of these products. So again, you have an existing Facebook ad creative that you can use as inspiration. It gives you that starting point. There's gonna be no mental block because you have examples of everything to use for your own business. I will of course be going over the profit margins. So you'll get to see exactly how much you can buy these products from, what your competitors are selling for, and therefore whatever's left in the middle, that's what you can afford to spend on Facebook to make sure that you turn a profit. And last but certainly not least, I did a video on this yesterday, Facebook ad interests, how to pick the best Facebook ad interests for your products. So to give you some suggestions so you can get started as soon as possible, I will be showing you these for each and every product. Product number one is this reflective raincoat for a dog. This is a massively popular product right now and it's also selling, it's proven guaranteed seller on Facebook and I'm gonna show you the creative for it in a second. Before we go any further though, this presentation which I'm working through, which has the links for AliExpress, Google Trends, Facebook ad creatives, competitor links, profit margins. If you want a copy of this, I will post it in the pinned comment at the top of this video once we hit 60 likes. We got 50 likes on the previous video, so if we can get this one to 60, that'll be awesome. And you will find the link there for free. You can get access to all of these links and get selling these products right away. So this is the supplier that I found on AliExpress. They're called Green Pet Store. They've been in business for a couple of years, which doesn't sound like a lot but for an aliexpress supplier that is 96.3 percent is pretty decent as well and we can see all of the ratings they have are above average so if you did want to go down the aliexpress route then these guys are pretty decent but like i said in the intro do everything in your power to try and source it off of aliexpress because agents and dedicated dropshipping teams will be much more reliable and there'll be higher quality products as well so basically what this product is, is it's a reflective raincoat. So I believe they've got a pretty decent image. I'll try and find a better one to show you guys, but you can kind of see in this image here how when a torch hits it or when headlights hit it, it lights up. It's like those running jackets, which you've seen before, but for your dog, it also has different Velcro labels. So if somebody has a dog which is susceptible to anxiety or they're not very friendly, they can put those patches on there. So that's two different features of it. And the third feature of it is obviously being waterproof as well so it's inevitable certainly here in the uk people will have to walk their dogs in the rain and in the dark and this product is the perfect solution to this these are the tags that i was talking about there's a whole business in itself to be made from these through the covid period hundreds if not thousands of people thousands of people i would say adopted dogs through the covid period everybody was spending all day at home to look after their dogs but when people started going back to work the rates of anxiety and separation anxiety in dogs has massively gone up so more and more people are getting these harnesses and these patches to put on their dog to let people know that their dog 
can and can't do certain things, whether you shouldn't pet it or stroke it or whether it's there for support reasons. Just to confirm, this product is in demand. This is Google Trend information for the UK 2004 to present. We can see there's a massive spike in popularity right now for this exact product. This is the Facebook ad creative I wanted to show you. In the top right hand corner, you will see it's got a million views. Um, the actual creative itself is brilliant. It's not just a random selection of different clips kind of bundled in together with some cheesy music over the top. These are real people really walking a dog, actually walking a dog, showing the real life application for this product. I believe somewhere towards the end it shows its reflective capabilities and that is amazing. People will absolutely love this product. And if I can bring up these comments and just show you that people are posting pictures of their dog wearing this product. So people are genuinely buying this as well. If you want to sell this product, these are your competitors. These are the guys using that ad creative, which we've seen has been effective, has been successful. They're selling the product for a small for 40 pounds. It's the same price, no matter the size, which I would indeed recommend myself. Um, there's, are they goggles? <laughs> I didn't see these the first time round, but there's an upsell offer there for coat and goggles. I can't imagine, to be honest, most people would go for the goggles, but hey, it doesn't hurt to have it on there. In itself, it's a 40 pound product. You'll be able to make a profit on this on the front end without any upsells or cross sales. As we can see though, a pretty decent looking professional store. They have this 62 questions feature, which, which is my first time seeing this on a store. As we can see, there's lots of images and actual videos too of the product being used, which are brilliant for social proof. So definitely get that sort of thing um, onto your store to help with that. Because there is so much information about it, detail, size and everything, they've got these bullet points because as you can imagine, on a mobile phone having to scroll through all of this information and scroll all the way back up, it's really gonna affect and harm your conversion rate. So I definitely recommend implementing a similar layout. We saw we can buy it for £10.84. We saw you can sell it for 39.99, which leaves a very healthy profit margin of 29 and 15. My recommended Facebook interests would be geared around people who love getting outside love going on walks, love going on hikes and want to take their dog with them. So targeting things like dog walking, dog behavior, winter walks and hiking, you're gonna make sure that you're honing in on those people. And so that was product number one, the reflective raincoat. I forgot to mention in the introduction, if you are looking to still get your business started as quickly as possible, make sure you check out my free training. Um, it will be the top link in the video description below. It will show you how to go from scratch from literally day one and launch your business in the next 21 days and start making sales, which still leaves time to make the most of this Q4 period. Moving on to products number two is this interactive toy. You may have seen this featured on my channel before. However, this is a slightly different variation. Some of my best selling products have been products like this, variations of already tried and tested products. And the reason being is because the product is essentially the same, but it just looks different, which is perfect because people become numb. If they keep seeing the same product over and over again they just become numb to it they don't even see it they'll just continue to scroll past it so if you can take something which is tried and tested but advertised by loads of people and sell something that does essentially the same thing but in a slightly different way you're gonna recapture those people's attention and you already have a tried and tested product so products like this are brilliant definitely don't skip this one so this is the supplier that I found on Aliexpress they're a top brand they specifically focus on pet products which is awesome 98.4 percent positive feedback and green or above um, in their ratings there's many different options which give you different variations even upsells to offer on your shopify store which is great for hooking people in in a really low kind of barrier to entry price but then once they get on their store they see a bigger and better product for a slightly higher price to kind of help them encourage to spend them more this is the tried and tested product, which has thousands of comments, thousands of happy comments, which I'll be showing you in a second. However, if it was me, I'd be sharing or I'd be selling, sorry, this variation here, because essentially it does the same thing. However, it's different. So it's going to recapture those people's attention, which are used to selling this product. It's also slightly cheaper, which helps with the profit margins. Just to prove it is indeed in demand. If we take a look 2004 to present for dog toy. We can see it's about to hit its peak popularity in December. So you've still got a few weeks weeks yet to make the most of this one. If we have a look at the Facebook ad creative itself, we can see just a super simple yet effective ad. It looks like somebody's actually ordered this and filmed this content themselves using their own dog, um, but filmed on a mobile phone device, super easy to create yet super effective. 
there's no better way to demonstrate a product than actually show the end user using it, having fun using it. And people just like to watch videos of this regardless of whether it's selling a product because they wanna see a cute dog doing cute things. Just to prove people are indeed loving this product, we can see 11,000 reactions, 4,000 comments, over 2,000 shares. And let's just take a look at what people are posting. So the company itself is posting reviews from customers, which is obviously a great tactic. But we can also see there's lots and lots of comments from customers just ordered. Our Goldens love it. Somebody's posted a video of their dog using it, another person, another person, another person, another person, another person, another person, so on and so forth. You get the idea. People love this product, but it's already been done pretty extensively to these guys. So selling a slight variation of this, you're gonna be onto a winner. What's great about this product or the guys selling this product, they just use a very simple, free, straightforward, debutified theme. This is a winning product description and layout. So you can use this to your heart's content to replicate something similar and you know it's going to work. Just to point out some of my favorite features of this store is this section here, the Carrot Patch Veterinarian veterinarian approved benefits. And they also have another features section here. So they do it in a slightly different way. They do it in a nice condensed way, demonstrating with nice cute pictures of cute dogs and kids just to help sell the product. Moving on to profit margins, we just saw we can buy it for $14.33 with free delivery. The recommended retail price, in my opinion, will be $39.99. That's because that's what Carrot Patch are selling it for. And we know it sells successfully at that price, which leads a very healthy profit margin of $25.66. My recommended Facebook interests would be to target those people who love to buy toys for their dogs because this is a dog toy. So this would be things like dog toy, it would be Kong, it would be dog collar, and it would be dog training too because there's a lot of owners out there that use toys as a way to train their dogs also. Moving on to product number three is this really cool effect. It's a wooden carved animal lamp but as you can see there's like a scene carved into the heart of the lamp which is then lit up by an led bulb a really neat looking product a really wow factor and it has a massive unique selling point and captures lots of attention on social media i found a supplier on aliexpress which sells lots of different variants from lots of different animals, which is brilliant because one thing that I would test with this product is a carousel ad with all the different animals and just put it out to everybody, put it out to a super broad audience because you're gonna be capturing people who like different things. And by putting every single animal on that carousel ad, the chances are you're always gonna find somebody who is interested in one animal or another. So, so definitely great products that's gonna capture lots of attention on social media. This is backed up in the Google Trends information too. We can see we're just about to hit peak popularity because it is getting dark here in the UK more and more people are looking for LED lamps and rather than buy a cheap boring one why not get them to buy a super exciting unique one like this which they've never seen before this is the Facebook ad that I found that you can use as inspiration which is getting a pretty decent amount of engagement and as you can see it's a very basic ad there's not really a lot to it. You could probably get away with just a single image ad. So you don't need to invest a ton amount of time into getting a creative, just a single image ad is all you will need because there's not a lot more that a video can say about a product than an image can in this instance. As for your competition selling this product, I definitely think that everybody can outdo these guys. It's a very basic-y looking Shopify store um, with a very default template. It doesn't look super professional. If it was me, it's also a generic store called Idea Rock. If it was me, I would build a one product niche store around like wooden hand carved products to really kind of set yourself up as the original and unique seller. What they also don't have on this store is reviews for the product, which is a massive no-no. It is a God-given fact that reviews help sell a product as long as they're positive, of course. So definitely make sure you get some reviews on your product page. As for numbers then, we just saw we can buy this product for 852. My recommended retail price would be 30 pounds, but I think that's slightly on the cheap end, to be honest. I'd definitely start there to see how things go. And if you find it just kind of takes off, the traction just comes from day one, I'd start to bump up that price week on week and just make sure it doesn't affect your conversion rate because there's so much detail and like uniqueness and wow factor to this product that something like that definitely warrants a higher price ticket than 30 pounds in my opinion but it, even still with this lower price bracket you're still looking at approximately 21.47 per sale my facebook interest for this product would be to start with an animal so if you wanted to sell the wolf one that could be your base interest and then i would combine this with people who have a passion for interior design you can actually target led lamp believe it or not as an interest too so people who have shown interest in those things but then combine 
combine that with their love for animals. And like I said, a carousel ad with every single animal an individual image I think would be a great start. Moving on to product number four are these animal socks. Now, to be honest, I usually stay away from cheap products like this. However, they're super in demand and there's also some existing sellers which are seeing some success with them. People like to buy socks at Christmas. It's just a fact. If we take a look at the Google Trends information, there is a massive spike in demand and popularity for socks come November, December time. So it's just a fact that people buy socks to give us gifts at Christmas. And that's where your market is. There's people not necessarily knowing what to get someone. So they'll just get them a cheap pair of novelty socks so they can tick them off the list and they don't look bad for not getting them anything. This is the supply I found on AliExpress, my private wardrobe store, 97.2% feedback established in 2021. There's lots of different variations. So again, you could adopt that same and similar approach I mentioned for the previous products of running a carousel ad, super cheap products at £3.42. You do have to add on a shipping cost there of £2.69, but for that you get 15 day on time guarantee. As for pre-existing Facebook ads then, again, just a single image ads pretty much tells the whole story for a product like this. So super quick, super cheap to get started in. As I mentioned earlier, these guys have got some serious traction. Well, 6,000 engagements in serious traction actually, but 4,000 comments is pretty good. Near into 1,000 shares, which is also good. All the comments are fairly recent as well. So three weeks, 15 hours, three weeks, three days, three days, three weeks, one week. Um, there was a couple of people in here who say they have them as well. So people are actually buying these. You can see people are getting excited about them. She's got the crocodile ones. So definitely a product that people are generally excited and interested about and actually buying as well. So that's why it gets to feature in this video still. As for the Shopify store, it's using a layout very similar to a store we've already looked at. You could definitely approve upon this using a more custom theme and using a product page editor like Gem Pages or something like this. But to be honest, it is a fairly simple product. The image itself kind of sells it. All you have to do is make sure that when people come onto your store, you look trust you look trustworthy enough to shop with and you should be able to secure the sale itself. I would definitely couple this with a really good upsell. So let's see what happens if I hit add to cart. And then let's see if I, when I hit checkout, there's nothing. So if it was me, I would definitely be adding a function or a feature where people hit that checkout button and they get hit with a pop-up that says buy a second pair for 20% off or get three pairs for two or something like that just to try and encourage people to spend a bit more money and therefore bump up your average order value so you can turn a profit on that front end. Plus it's the sort of product where if you're going to get one pair of socks for somebody you don't know what to buy for, you'll probably think oh, I could get two or three pairs and buy for him, her and whoever. As for the numbers we're just seeing including shipping is six pound and a penny. My recommended retail price would be in and around £20. That seems in and around where most kind of novelty pairs of socks come in, which leaves a profit margin, a pretty tight profit margin of £13.98. But like I said, get a good upsell or cross-sell offer and you'll be able to bump that up and make a profit, no problem. As for Facebook interests, you can actually target socks as an interest, believe it or not, but I would couple this with people who are looking for gifts to buy for people at Christmas. So target things like Christmas shopping, engaged shoppers and online shopping. Engaged shoppers obviously being those people who have clicked the shop now button in the past seven days. So they're happy and used to shopping from ads on Facebook. Moving on to product number five, one of my favorite, a bit of a wildcard one is this this dinosaur play park. It's the perfect gift for Christmas because it allows multiple people to play at one time. It's also a great photo opportunity. When you see your child having fun playing with something cute like this and dinosaurs, everybody wants to take pictures. Everybody can get involved on Christmas day as well. So it makes the perfect kind of Christmas activity for brothers and sisters and even parents to get involved and even grandparents as well. What is slightly different about this product though is from a supplier called Avasam is a UK based drop shipping supplier. So we can see it ships to the UK in three to four days. You can actually get 24 hours for £8.33. There's no need though, you could go for the cheaper options and still have it sent, tracked, delivered to your customer in three to four days. This also allows you to take fuller advantage of Q4 and sell closer to that cutoff deadline. I didn't really know what to put in on Google Trends. I didn't just wanna put kids toys because and it's going to be clear and obvious that that's going to be massively popular in demand now. So I'll put board game in because it kind of is a board game except you play it on a mat. Perhaps it will give some of you guys further ideas to maybe look at more specific like board games. But either way, coming into Q4, November, December time, 
massive popularity for products like this. As for competitors, couldn't find any pre-existing one, anybody actually selling this product, which is another positive, another plus for this product. I think I mentioned it earlier on the video, if you can be one of the first people to bring a product to market that people have never seen before, it's definitely gonna capture attention and definitely gonna be onto a winner. So that's one of the reasons why I love Avasam is, they do have some products from AliExpress, but most of their products are quite unique, never seen before. So if you are looking to start a dropshipping business in the UK, then definitely check out Avasam. As for numbers, including VAT, we saw we can buy it for 520. My retail price would be 29.99, which I think is reasonable for a mat, some figurines and that sort of thing. You could probably get away with a bit higher actually. Even so, this leaves a pretty healthy profit margin of 24 pounds and 79 pence. As for my recommended Facebook interests, there's a couple of spins, a couple of angles here. Obviously we need to target toys. Um, I definitely think we should target people, parents I should say, with preschoolers. So this is the perfect age range for a toy like this, three to five years old. Target people interested in dinosaurs, so then you're coupling those two interests. And last but not least, gift and grandparent. Grandparents by far, from my own experience, have been the strongest buyers on Facebook. So by targeting grandparents who are looking for gifts, but also have an interest in dinosaurs, then I think you're gonna be on a winner. And so with that being said then guys, that is all five products I wanted to show you in this video. I hope you've stuck with me. If you have, I really do appreciate it. I mentioned it earlier on in the video. If you're looking for a free training to help you get started in dropshipping as quickly as possible and you want an extra 194 profitable product ideas, make sure you check out my free training in the top link below. Thanks for watching, guys, and have an awesome Q4.